Ahoy there, I'm Tony Pirate and welcome back to Mega Aquarium. We are on the second level, way, and we just, I didn't do the first level, we just unlocked some new stuff. First level was just tutorials, so we're just working through this. We got a new uh, reef squirrel fish. Um, that one. And what we need to do is take all the stuff out of our email and, and put it in a, in a fish tank, since the game has asked us to do that. Sound, whoa, come here. All right, give me back control game. Okay, close that. Put all these little decorations down in the fish tank. They're very adorable. Is that one that goes in the fish tank? Sure, why not? A, a barrel just hanging around. Rotate that. Beautiful. Oh, wow, impressive. Look at the tank. Transport it to another time. Okay, we can decorate it. All right, well, do I want to decorate it? Uh, yes, I maybe do. A shipwreck paint. There we go. Wow, we can go around and do shipwreck paints on everything. Let's let's shipwreck paint our aquarium up. Oh, wow. I'm feeling slightly committed now. <laughs> I have to paint everything because you know, you know, heaven forbid, I, I don't do that. That is a little disgusting, if you ask me. But. It's a decision that's been made. Can't really change that now. I suppose I could have themed areas, right? Maybe I'll fiddle with this a little bit, but maybe not right now. I might do that off air. Maybe we'll just go up to here with the shipwreck paint. And then we can do the other kind of paint. Where are you, decoration? Um, I think we'll just go with blue paint around here for now. So, okay, we got our ridiculous shipwrecked area and our normal area. We've got this here. It's time to put some fishies in this one. So what I wanted to put was this hermit crab. So it's a crustacean. It will clean things for us. It's quite expensive. Uh, we have to be careful that we don't put other things in here that are going to eat crustaceans. What does it need? I th oh, ah, okay, we haven't put it in any of the gear yet to keep this thing alive. We'll do that. And then we'll put in a large filter like that. Maybe like that. And then we'll try and get... Oh, it's not quite enough. Uh, sell that. Put in a, a combi, perhaps. All right, that'll do the trick for now. We'll get the large heaters in a minute. So that's a happier crabs or two in there. Why not three? I think things look good in sets of three. We have another new fish as well. Where are you? Oh, you're there, aren't you? I think it was a reef squirrel fish. It likes to be in groups of four and doesn't like bright lights. Were there any other fish that we are short on in the aquarium? This one... It eats crustaceans with size two or less. I'm pretty sure that is how it, how it guys. Cannot be housed with other flame fish. Eats clam and coral, but not other stuff. Yeah, so we'll put this guy in and oh we need a we need more decorations for these we need some beautiful kelp and we need a where are you a large rock formation um we'll do that and maybe some seagrass along the back something like that i think that looks pretty good yeah that's a great that's a great fish tank it's looking beautiful we, do we have any other issues? That floor, I must admit, is just grossing me out quite uh, quite something else. Um, yeah, I think we're going to return the floor to normal. I wish I could drag the whole floor away. Oh no, we need bins. Oh gosh, okay. Let's, we can't leave that lying around. I don't mind the walls being themed, but the floor... Hmm, it's just a bit too... It's a bit too rustic for me. If we had a rustic corner, I could perhaps accept that, but not the whole place. And uh, we need that equipment now. So we need a broom stand. Put one here and maybe... Yep, and we'll put one over on this side. Um, maybe, yeah, like that. And then we need some litter bins. I saw them pop as well. And we can put one next to our food. Um... Or our drink vending, we could put one, I don't know, near the entrance. And they probably have, oh look, they do have a radius, so you can just put one here. 
one here. And I don't really want to put one in front of the fish tanks, so I think we're just going to... I'll put one maybe there. There we go. That seems sensible. And what are we looking at? We've got fish research going on. We have uh, lots of the tech research going on. And we've got a really big, beautiful, beautiful fish tank. These lagoon tanks are pretty cool. Now, arguably, I could also squeeze some tanks in along this wall. I might try that. It wouldn't be that expensive to do, and I can just expand this way to fit the, maybe to fit the filters in. Yep, something like that would be cool. And so I can move this uh, that way. Oh, I need, I think probably a couple of chairs. Uh, move that one a bit closer. There we go, now people can check it out. Look at the beautiful crabs in there, having a little swim around. It's all very adorable. Now, is this fish that we are going to get going to be bad? Uh, can't handle that one. Can't handle other green. Oh, so this one requires green. This one requires green, orange, green. Is there any room in there? You know, we have a uh, fishy that we've got in here. Big moray eel. And the one that we've just... I cannot handle anyone else with green palettes. It's size 7. What are you? You're size 9. What do you eat? Crustaceans with size 3 or less. And you... You may eat size... Oh, okay. So we can put this guy in here. No! Too big! It might be time for a little a wall tank. So I'm thinking around about here. And we can just drop one in real easy like this. Um, it actually might be picking up nearby... I think it is. Oh, actually, this needs to be pulled back. I think it's picking up heating from its adjacent... the two adjacent things here, so that's cool. So, you... where were you, little fishy? The fox face rabbit fish. And you need... oh. No, actually, you do need your own water quality and all that kind of stuff, so... We can do that with a large filter and I think we can just do that with a power heater and that's probably fine and then we can just give you guys a bit of decorations now oh, the anchor's kind of cute I thought that was quite pretty um, 2211 some plants would be yep, that's not as too shallow for that few plants and some other bits and bobs I don't know what else should we chuck in there some rubble let's have a look you need a bit of food but other than that you're all right For lots of repairs required which is a bit concerning no nope. we probably want that extra staff member is what I think Fixing, cleaning, fixing, fixing and feeding, fixing, cleaning. Uh, yeah, we'll just hire you. Alright, get out of here. Alright, well, we've accumulated stuff. Yay, we've won at North Woods. We've done a great job. And now we can go on and take the job, and another job at Elmserhorn. But let's have a look at our little, little fish tanks. Everything's going very good. We've unlocked an armored animal. That's also good. So I'll have a quick squeeze of that while we're here. So you see, this is a like a puffer fish. I think he puffs up. And he acts as double his effective size. So his effective size of eight. He does grow. He may eat starfish. And he requires cockles. So I'm going to put a couple in there and just put the food down. Cockles. Dispensing cockles. Here we go. And pop that there. So there you go, a very pretty, I think a very pretty little aquarium. And the large heater's done as well. Hello, we're gonna have a little walk around. Hi, how's it going everyone? You enjoying my uh enjoying my little aquarium? Don't look up. It's existential dread all the way down. Oh, we're gonna have a little walk through the fish tank here. See the little crabs down there, they're adorable. They do grow a little bit. Very cute, nice fish. How are our moray eels doing? Oh, shift doesn't make me run, what a shame. Have a little look over here. More eels, are you are you happy? Wow, you are a big lad, aren't you? You're definitely a, a, quite a unit. I am in awe of the size 
of that one. That lad, he's great. And this one, even bigger, I think. Not flexible, though. He seems to have become a little, little rigid in his old age. Never mind. So I think that's probably a good time to move on to the next the next challenge, which we can do. Uh, oh, armored animals. Yes, we can do here with a win. Yay, take the job in Elmzerahorn. Awesome. So we're going to have a look here at this aquarium jobby. So this aquarium jobby is a little, or can be a little tricky to get started because they've got a large fish tank, but they have a lot of requirements that we that we need to uh, work on. Um, I think we should be very careful when we place things or it's all going to go horribly wrong. So we have the fish tank here. We need to hit a whole bunch of uh, requirements and that's a lot of research. So this guy requires, uh, should be in a group of four. He gets 10 on his own. So I think it's basically one, two, three, at least four already. Um, actually, I will, I will put in this uh, thing now, which will just up their happiness. Cool. And what else is required? Let me have a look. So we got four of them. This guy I don't trust in a tank on his own. He'll just he'll eventually just eat something. I'm I'm sure of it. Uh, he's size four, but he doesn't grow, so eventually he will get eaten by the big fish. Uh, he should be okay as well, and they use the same type of food, which is going to be quite important for us. Uh, two, three, four, six. I'm actually just going to go straight there. Across all the animals, I need the green one. So who's got the most green on them? You do. Okay, so they eat green pellets. You could do fine for us. So 20 a throw. Just no clams or anything else in there. You'll be fine. Okay, so clams or crustaceans? No, you're fine. Oh. Dislikes con species. Cannot be housed with flame angle anglefish. That's okay. We're up to 12. Uh, what is this one not like? This one is pretty good. Let's have a look. How many can I get to? All right, so we do have the issue of uh, expanding this somewhat so we can get to the fish and the food. I can put in some kelp in this high tank, which is good. And what else should I put in here? Some other decorations. An anchor. It's always adorable. And I will need a green and a, a, a where are you one of them and i don't think i need muscles at present but i will need a tool station so i'm gonna have to work out a way to jam more bits in around it i do have a pump so i could immediately like cut out i could cut out something over here and put in some walls And I might just cut that out for now because we're getting a bit poor, you see? Got to be a bit careful about this one. So a few drinks machines just to help the money earning would be a smart idea. And then hopefully the basic facilities that I need. So that will mean a power combi perhaps. Um... It's actually just filtering I need now, so I might as well not spend it on the big one. How's that? Open aquarium. Six different animals. Oh, do we need more? Can we fit this guy in? I think he's okay. Uh, oh, and of course, water quality drops. So uh, another power filter. Oh, and another power filter. I really want the large one. And one more type of fish. Were there any bullies in there? No, not a bully. Not a bully. Not a bully. Oh, some of these might 
Yeah, I can't put anything else. Oh, have I messed up the not with a co re squirrel fish? Where's the one that doesn't like other green uh, other green food eaters? No, I think I'm okay. No, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So what I could do is there much room in there? Uh, let's get rid of all this. I think there is a little bit of room in there to. I can just check with that. There's a bit of room in there. I can probably get four of these in. Oh. Um. Or not. I will have to sort that out. Okay, water quality is not the best, but sufficient. Sufficient water quality, really? I will. Um. Do I have to seriously set up like another? Oh no! I know what I can do. Let me get some of these down. That should want I want some more decorations. They actually do enhance water quality. All right. All right. Everything is good. Open aquarium. Phew. And we're down to 950. So that was pretty poor. Okay. So they want corals. We're gonna get some science and what have you. And we've got to earn some of the unlocks for the corals. So that's the, the first coral we want to unlock. And we want a protein skimmer because this thing is useful for making very high uh, water quality on small tanks. And it's going to be very useful for our corals since they require very high water quality as it turns out. We should probably have a staff member. Yep, you'll do. And... Well, maybe some seats for tired guests. Get them to refresh their energy watching our fish. Um, why are you not... No access for staff? Okay, that's fine. They can all just come down the side. So, yep, yeah, walked up the little ladder there to feed the fish. Brilliant. Everything else seems to be going... Okay, that's a pretty diverse fish tank. I'm pretty pleased with that for a single fish tank. That's done okay. It would seem to make sense, I reckon, to chuck some more fish tanks in along this wall. Um, and that's definitely a goal once we've got... Well, we've got a bit of money now. So I might just do that straight away. I can just pop this over here. Here. And then just uh, tear up those. Uh, actually, I'll move this over here that there. Let's see what we can do for a wall tank. Um, yep. I like I like that. Alright. Let's put in the wall. Seal it up. So this to me is where I can put I should definitely put two, three, four and grab the one out of here. Because this one won't uh, be happy on its own. Pop them in there with his buddies. See, I can see sort of a health bar. I can kind of keep an eye on them. And what can I do? I can do this here. And then that there. And that should be pretty good. Now I can definitely put in... Uh, we should put in some fish food over here. And I'm not exactly sure which ones we're going to require. So we'll just put in a bit of everything. Um, and the mussels. And that was right. And a, uh, a broom stand. And a tool station. And some decorations. Where are you? A water quality one. A rocky overhang. And a bunch of grass at the back. Okay, so what fish don't we have? Not five of them. He's a he's a these are great, but this guy's a wimp. So maybe we'll just kind of fill this tank up now. There we go, one full tank. And that's just a very pretty tank full of lots of little pretty fish, and we can forget about it. It's all done. Don't have to add anything else to it ever again. It's sorted. And yeah, I reckon that looks okay. I sort of think what I might do is have a very similar arrangement on the other side. So I just need to wait for my cash to go up a little bit. And then we'll expand the aquarium out down this to the back here. And maybe we'll be able to hook this up. We'll tear this down and hook this up to like an off-site 
power facility like this, but we're just going to need more of the the power power junk before we can achieve that. So we need, yeah, we need a tank with mushrooms and the the sort of coral and the protein skim and lighting, water quality, heating. So that tank can go over here. I might get a moray tank started as well. Oh, the water quality is again dropped. Hey, that's such a pain. So, where's a small rock? Um, no, not the whole contents. We don't want to sell the whole contents of the tank. Of the tank. We just want to sell that. And then maybe I can put in some small rocks. Uh, 69 or 70. Uh, so annoying. We, we need that. I need that research to be done. 68. Ah. Uh, and temperature is falling as well. Really? Oh, this needs to be repaired. Would that help? It starts to wear on the fish and they start to get unwell, as you can see. It's because... I'm not exactly sure why. I'm not sure if it's because they're growing. But it isn't ideal. Um, let me get feeding and fixing another staff member. Maybe feeding them will help cheer them up a bit. The fish could also, I think, do with a rubbish bin over here. So we will put that there. That should help things along a bit. Now, where else can I jam some more stuff in? I think it, it might be time to look at expanding out over here. So what did we do? Something... So that's like one, two, three, four, five, six. So back from the edge, one, two, three, four, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll go with a wall. Um, try and keep it kind of vaguely even. One, two, door. And uh, just get, we'll just get that power filter running so that I don't have to worry myself anymore about these jolly fishies. That will be fine. Nope. Oh, you. Um, right, now you're in range. Cool. So, can we just do that? Yeah, we can. Excellent. Okay, that's a, that's almost ready. I think maybe we will. Maybe we will put in a medium, like a good size moray eel tank. A wall tank here. Like how many moray eels could we actually get in there? Do you eat crustaceans? You do eat... Oh, you're not going to grow and these guys will grow. So we'll have two, give them a cave, and then give them the, the pleasures of life, which uh, is like that. And some food. Cool. And I think a little bit of, a little bit of the old uh, decorations, uh, maybe a conch here, and uh, a shell here, and some wavy grass and maybe a, another where are we I can anchor okay cool so that is wow that's a beautifully equipped evenly laid out little aquarium except for the except for the part where I screwed it all up other than that it's brilliant I think it's fantastic and you know what I think now might be a good time to pause because in the next episode we're gonna have to set up a wonderful corals and make them all work very very well and I need to I need to I need to fix this because I'm a bit of an egg yeah corals they are done and we can start looking at the next thing to research and I think it's gonna be this crazy looking lionfish don't know really why I want it but it's adorable so we're gonna get it lights are on their way too so we're gonna do that in the next episode I hope you'll join me I've been tiny pirate this has been mega aquarium and uh, you can find it on the Steam store very shortly. Until next time, good night.